It's been eight years since the world has seen a Deus Ex title. The original Deus Ex was released back in 2000 on the PC and was held highly by many as one of the greatest games of the time. It allowed the players to make their own choices, gave them the freedom of taking a level how they wanted and providing them with a story filled with conspiracy and a narrative that would keep them guessing and wanting more. It was shortly followed after by Deus Ex Invisible War. This offered the same experience as the first title, but in a more constricted way. Deus Ex Human Revolution looks to expand even more on what made the original title popular, but can it succeed in a market populated by clones? Is everything in place? Almost. What do you mean, almost? The story of Deus Ex Human Revolution follows Adam Jensen, an ex-SWAT member turned private security. He is tasked with protecting a group of scientists before a historical meeting that could change the course of history. Before that could even take place, a band of mercenaries attacks Seraph Industries and injures Jensen greatly. This forces him to get a life-saving augmentation so he won't die. Now you must find out who attacked and why they even attacked the company in the first place. It's a story full of conspiracy and twists that will keep you guessing and holding the controller from start to finish. The gameplay of Human Revolution is the main attraction to the title. You can choose to take the game any way you like, taking it pure stealth, pure combat or a mixture of the two. Each has its own satisfying feeling to go with it, such as making it through undetected or cleaning out an entire room full of enemies. The gameplay will have you hooked as soon as you're put into Jensen's shoes. This also adds to the replay values of the game, as there are so many different ways to take on your objective. You'll also have the ability to upgrade both your weapons and augmentations, making yourself better suited for either stealth or combat. You can add silences to your weapons, making it easier to get past opponents, or add explosive rounds into your revolver to cause a bit more chaos. You can choose a cloaking ability to help you sneak past foes, or you can add an upgrade that lets Adam release bombs in a 360 degree angle. You truly have complete freedom to take things your way in Human Revolution. The graphics in Deus Ex Human Revolution are very satisfying to look at. The cyberpunk style and very run-down, grungy environments add mood to the setting and truly make you feel that you're walking through a seedy part of Detroit and Hensa. The view of the entire upper city is quite beautiful and the game uses a great combination of architecture and lighting to give the player a sense of being an ant among all the giant buildings. Yes, may I help you? Actually, I've been told by a mutual acquaintance that it might be the other way around. Were you followed? While the overall graphics are solid, it falls short on some of the voiceovers. Jensen's voice doesn't quite manage to match his appearance. Other NPCs in the game have great voices, while, just like Jensen, some are completely way off the mark from what they look like. The background noises and music, however, all add diversity, from a woman screaming in the distance to a street performer dancing to music. This all comes together to breathe life into the various places you'll visit. Overall, Deus Ex Human Revolution is one of the best games to be released so far this year. It has a wonderful story, some great gameplay and an atmosphere that will have you hooked as soon as you start the game. Minor glitches may get in the way from time to time, but the game makes up for it in content and replay value. If you're a gamer that loves shooters, stealth or roleplay games alike, Deus Ex Human Revolution will not disappoint you. For our written review, please check out JustPushStart.com. This is Oliver East, signing out.